Integrating the four C's and digital tools into the classroom environment promotes innovation and learning for today. Recently, sixth grade students at Elmwood Elementary School completed group haiku wiki projects on Egypt. Students work collaboratively in groups to answer their identified essential question by creating and publishing a wiki project that included text and visual content, along with the integration of Google Slides presentations and maps they created. The project promoted critical thinking and creation as students worked within their group to design their own online presence within their haiku classroom. I focused a lot on dispositions to this project since we're doing an online project and the students are managing themselves. I've spoken about dispositions almost every single day. Think about your engagement disposition today. Think about your creativity disposition today. And that's really helped the students to stay focused on what they need to be doing for this project. The question that we focused on was kind of what were the Pharaoh's greatest achievements during their rule. For each Pharaoh, we made a page. And in their page, we kind of wrote a couple paragraphs about them and wrote down their achievements. So they actually have to be creative in the way that they set up their page. And in order to do that, you have to critically think about that. How is the best way to lay out this information? And then with the resources that they're using, they need to critically think about, is this valid? Can I use this resource? Does this make sense? Does this work with my project? And they have to take all the information that they're gathering about this one uh, topic and they have to kind of condense it and make it their own. And that takes a lot of work and a lot of critical thinking skills. Well, I already made my Google slide and uploaded that to Haiku so you can see it on my board. And what I'm going to do with the map is I'm going to create this map based off this these pictures. <laughs> And I'm going to take a picture of that and upload it to my board on Haiku. My essential question was, uh, how did written language, various art forms, and architecture shape and affect Egypt? And first, we gathered evidence to show that Egyptians had art <coughs> and that they really believed in the written language. And Collaboration is huge with this project. If you're not collaborating on Haiku, um, wiki projects correctly, then you might be deleting your partner's work. Um, if you're not collaborating, you don't know what who's doing what page. You could be doing the exact same page at the same time and not even know it. Uh, so the students are actually really learning how to com communicate and collaborate within this project so effectively. I think it was a lot easier to work with a partner because then it's like, because then like when you, if you type something, you kind of know like this person can help me check it and like be sure everything sounds right. Yeah, because we can also collaborate lab on ideas and when I'm working on maybe pharaohs in the social class, Caitlin could be working on the peasants and we, it really helped because it saved a lot of time but we also had different ideas.